I was going to take Christmas Eve and Christmas Day off, and yet, here we are, Robert. Like, the Incredibles, okay. Well, I have driven with Raymond, and he does indeed drive and operate the vehicle in all of its particulars with one hand, in a flawless capacity. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. You do. I, I took note of it while we were driving. I said nothing about it while we were driving. I felt very mature. But now I finally get to mention it, and for a good cause. Laura, you're talking through this whole thing, and here I am taking you apart like a buzzard uh, rips apart a carcass. And you, like a carcass, are insensible to all of it. Sorry. <laughs> here I am. Thanks, Greg, but I think you and I are the only ones who are laughing at this, and that makes me a little bit sad because I, 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 I hid the irony a little too much. I, I sounded like I wanted to rip apart a carcass, and that's an issue. You know? <laughs> no, it's not an issue that I want to rip apart a carcass. It's an issue that I sound as if I were going to move on. Um. <laughs> And then Laura, she's inside, you know. <laughs> yeah, I don't think she respects you, Raymond. It's not cool. All right. I think they already talked this out. <laughs> no. <laughs> I wanted to talk about it. <laughs> no. I, I don't think I've been friends with anyone for as long as they've been friends with each other, so I'm, I'm, not, <laughs> I'm not in a position to criticize their relationship. Like, I have, I have friends from way back, but they're, like, from a distance now, because, like, we're just time zones away. I should call some people. It's Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody! Yeah! Hell yeah! Are you enjoying yourselves? Yeah. Sorry I just said all of that. That was sort of like, yeah, no, I mean, you get, like, a different sense when you have different kinds of conversations with people. I think that was just like someone jerking off in front of you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to move on from that, too. <laughs> Maybe I'm just too stoned. By the way, I'm holding this microphone stand like it's my only friend. I am a little bit stoned. So, but the, the contours are nice. It feels, I mean, but, you know, what am I going to do from here? It's like, oh, All right. Never lose control. Never lose control. All right, um, okay. Texas business owners be like, how big of a sign can I legally put out by the side of the road in front of this shop that I own? Have you seen some of those signs, you guys? Like, it's 90 feet tall enough? I don't know if it is. I fucking love it, dude. I don't know if there's a legal limit. And in, in California, in California, the Palos Verdes government felt so smug when they forced Donald Trump to make his 70-foot American flag. At the, I don't even give a fuck. I've just taken a walk and I've seen the golf course. But there used to be a 70-foot tall American flagpole. <laughs> Excuse me, at the end of this golf course in Palos Verdes. And he was like, I think it's un-American that they want to take down the flagpole. They're, they're telling me it's a, co a violation code. I had the best people come in and build it. Oh, guys, it was so hilarious. <laughs> like, I think he didn't even care about it. <laughs> I don't like Trump. Uh, you guys probably, <laughs> it doesn't, actually doesn't really matter to me at all. I don't watch the news. Yeah, we're not really surprised. Are you enjoying yourselves? Yeah. Okay, good, good. We're enjoying ourselves. Uh, yeah, no, I'm just, I'm finding out what's funny. <laughs> um, hmm. Cats are pretty freaking hilarious. I mean, like, you put a cucumber, any cucumber, next to any cat. And it sees it, and it immediately <laughs> freaks the fuck out because it thinks it's a snake. 
Which is pretty, I mean, it's not, I don't think it's nice to do to cats, but the fact is that the, the video footage is in, the evidence is in front of us, and there is no cat that does, <laughs> I mean, like, there's prop, if, mm, I haven't seen it yet, there's, ah, I mean, there's probably no cat, maybe some cat with, like, a brain birth defect. That that's not that that part of the universal cat DNA, which says snakes are bad, didn't get encoded. It's an exceptional case. What I'm saying is every cat freaks out when they see a cucumber. Hot damn! Maybe we got some things like that. <laughs> uh, like for instance, every time I. Fuck, this isn't going to be funny. <laughs> like, I saw myself headed toward the cliff. And like, it's the point of no return, Doc! We gotta put in the green one! Like, ah, oh, but the woman that uh, read the same shit as me is coming up on a skateboard. <laughs> uh, okay, well, I'll think of, I'll think of a comparison to make. It's gonna be like every time, like every time I see spinach between someone's teeth, it's just like, oh, I don't know. Or like, I was gonna say every time I see someone who looks like they could be a cult leader, but then I realized it looks like I'm gonna start a cult in the woods later. Fuck, I got blonde David Koresh. Anyone wanna get up to some wild shit later? I'm just gonna make it up as we go along. This is it. No, this might be a new. This might. This might be a new life trajectory for me, guys. I'm finding myself right now. <laughs> what would I do if I had a little, the least bit of power? I don't know. <laughs> Anyone who laughs like this and shows their toes in public doesn't exert influence over society. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> oh, but I could. And, uh, blonde David Koresh, gotcha, thank you. Um, Anyone else like root beer? Yeah, right? Stopped drinking it when I started drinking at regular beer. I love root beer. Why did I stop drinking root beer? I love root beer. It's like, it's like, it's like if a distillery had a nipple, root beer <laughs> would come out of it. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> it's like, who would give that up? But it, no, I, just, well, I mean, I just stopped drinking all soda. I'm like, well, if it's not going to have alcohol in it or be water, if it, if it isn't the most sobering thing or the thing that's going to fuck me up, well, then fuck that. I mean, I probably saved a few thousand dollars since I came to the age of maturity is because I didn't buy sodas and, or anything else calorie bearing, which is liquid. I just buy food. See, I have to be very frugal, because I'm super smart. I could probably get a very high-paying job, but I fucking can't be asked, and so I just make a dollar go really far, and I think that might be a sad way to live. <laughs> this is a ghost of Christmas past coming up on the future coming up on me. Yeah, that's the Grim Reaper one. It's like, yeah, the Grim Reaper looks like me, but uh, more skeletal. <laughs> he wears a he wears a gray jacket. Um, yeah. Well, I'm glad I'm glad I'm not wearing those boots I was wearing a couple of days ago because I got blisters on my toes and now I can be free again. And. Uh, Thank you all for, I mean, it, none of this, so, so little of this was of interest to anyone but myself, and I apologize for that. I, <sighs> Thanks, guys. Love you. Have a good night. <laughs> Derek. Derek Temple, everybody, recorded this set. Yeah. With his toes exposed, but everything else covered up. What the <laughs> fuck is going on in there? <laughs> so much I Like, he doesn't have his wrist showing or an ankle showing, but Lord forbid he cover the toes on Christmas Day, you know? It's that cult I'm starting. <laughs> oh, it's not cult below the ankle? Is that what it is? Exactly. Yeah. No, no one's gonna follow you into a cult like that. We play footsie, all right?
cult leaders tend to be really attractive, and Derek, you're just... Hey. You're just done. You look, I, you look like a lion with your, how, like, vertical okay. you're... <laughs> Laura, I'm beautiful. Don't even... Don't even. <laughs> I'm sure, I think I'm ugly, but I'm beautiful, okay? I'm sure your mother spoiled you rotten in that regard. No, 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 no. She said I look weird. <laughs> <laughs> and yet you have the confidence to keep your toes out in Christmas? It's more comfortable. <laughs> You're dressed like an elf. Yeah, because it's fucking Christmas. <laughs> but you look goofy dressed as an elf. So, shut up. <laughs> All right, uh, that's, that's been the open mic. That's, uh, that's been 